Hey, I thought you'd be halfway to Italy by now. Mm. I've seen Italy. I wanted to see it with you. I'm sorry, it's just... Yeah, if something came up, I know. Look, I realize you did me this huge favor for which I'm eternally grateful, but I wouldn't have married you if I didn't like you. And yes, I got control of my money, but I also got a friend in the process. I'll have my lawyer draft divorce papers and set you free. Oh, Louise, it's, it's not that at all. I, I love spending time with you and Italy sounds perfect, but. There's that butt again, and not the looks good in those pants kind. <laughs> Emily and I... No. You're sleeping together. No, 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 no. Um, Emily and I... Oh, God, how do I explain this? We're sort of like superheroes. Only in the sense that we do, uh, well, good things for people who deserve it and bad things to those who don't. And what are you on today? A mission of mercy or malice? How does merciful malice suit you? Lack of a perla. Maybe I can help. Hmm. Oh my goodness! This isn't Soul Sackle? Louise? You know her? Gosh darn it, I could have sworn Jack said the gym was on the eighth floor. Jack sent you here. I was at 8th Avenue. You know, I am so terrible with directions. I'm so sorry to interrupt. Um, Ma'am? Yes? Agent Westgate here is going to need to ask you a few questions before you go. Oh, my pleasure. This way, ma'am. So this little doohickey erased Margot's entire computer? Mm -hmm. Worked like a charm. Uh, now let's put that away before you do the same to mine. Well, thank you for trusting me. I don't. Seriously. Nice to feel included. I am so sorry. I didn't see it sooner. See what? How much we're alike. I mean, I spent most of my life as an outsider, and it, it felt awful. But then Emily showed up and trusted me to be her partner, and my life changed. So while our wedding was strategic, I did promise to be there for you. I'm so sorry that I wasn't. Perdóname. Yes. 